I learnt loads of new skills, loads of new knowledge and built up more confidence and now I'm quite proud to say that I'm a police officer. I'm PC Lauren Clayton and I'm a response officer for Derbyshire Constabulary. So before I was a police officer I'd just finished sixth form and was working my part-time jobs and I was just looking for careers I could look, in look into and I saw it advertised online. So I just applied for it, not really expecting much from it. Um, I applied for the PCSO role and the PCDA role and then I heard back and got an interview for both but the PCSO role application was slightly quicker so I got the opportunity to work as PCSO for about seven or eight months um, which I really enjoyed. Um, I learned so much because I had no policing background before other than I got family in the police so I heard a little bit but not really much um, and then I just joined PCDA and began training school again as a police officer which has been out on section now since March this year and I really enjoy it and I learnt loads of new skills, loads of new knowledge and built up more confidence. So when you're in training school there's people from all sorts of backgrounds there so it's the place where you get all your ground knowledge like they teach you loads of legislation that you need all the practical skills you need, knowledge on like the processes that you need to know when you're attending incidents and then you have like role plays and opportunities to practice these skills in action where you receive feedback so you learn a lot from those um, and they're all done in uniform and they're treated as real incidents so you get a proper feel for it. Officer safety training as well because some people might be worried about the physical side of things but you do get training in that and how to use all your equipment and then you're assessed on those as well there's like scenarios that you have to pass and things which are really fun to do and you get a lot of feedback from that and if you don't pass there's opportunities where you can get slightly more training and more help if you're struggling a little bit so the staff are there to help you. I was a bit nervous because being a police officer is quite different to being a PCSO so even though I'd got a bit of like prior knowledge and experience it was still like a whole new world so I was a little bit nervous but then you have your tutor with you who helps you and you can look to them for advice and follow what they do which is really helpful and then you build your confidence throughout your 10 weeks and then by the time you're at the end if you're at a point where your sergeant's saying yep yeah, you can go off on your own it's quite exciting like you can shout up and go to incidents and then you just feel like you know people are looking to you for help so you can really it's like a really good opportunity to just get stuck in and help people if you feel like you need more confidence you just have to express that to the trainers and the assessors and they'll give you more help or any help that you need or like they want to help you they want people to succeed basically so they'll do everything that they can to help you don't be put off if you've not got a policing background there's loads of people joining now that have never been in the police before don't know anybody in the police and they come and go through training school or tutorship and then they end up being really brilliant police officers and having lifelong careers so I would advise if you've got even the slightest bit of interest I would advise giving it a shot because now's the time obviously with all the recruitment 